Oh yeah. hotter than somebody left picky toe in some damn boots y'all it's hot happy wednesday welcome back to another vlog oh my god it's been a minute since i vlogged y'all the last time i vlogged was puerto rico if you haven't seen that vlog go ahead and watch it right now what are you doing it is wednesday as you guys can see by the title i will be in dallas tomorrow so i was like you know gotta vlog this experience because i'm a houston girl like i fell in love with houston when I went to Houston back in 20, 2017, I think, something like that. And, you know, Dallas, I never really got to explore Dallas like this, but I like it so far. I'm gonna actually explore, hopefully, tomorrow. Hopefully, y'all, hopefully. As of right now, I just dropped my mom off to do her nails. You know, I, I decided to look, you spoil her. See, I, cause I saw her toes and I was like, honey, we cannot be walking around like this, honey. This is not how we represent the family. So I went, I went to go, I said, I'm gonna pay for you to get your toes. I this lady talking about some, I'm gonna do my nails too. Oh, and I'm gonna do my eyebrows too. Girl, girl. And you know, I can't say no. Oh wait, I'm so busy talking to y'all. I'm, I totally missed my turn. I just dropped her off to do her, to her nails. I'm gonna go back to get a soak off. I need to soak off these nails y'all because um, I just want my nails to breathe right now. I feel like I've just been getting my nails done back to back to back. I like to let them breathe in between time. I'm about to go to Dunkin'. Y'all just pulled up to Dunkin'. I was that's so that's the turn that I forgot to go to. I'm gonna get a latte and a cream cheese bagel. So I see y'all. I got a caramel crazed latte. I never had that from them before. So and I love caramel latte. It looks really pretty. Can y'all see it? <laughs> whipped cream with like a caramel cinnamon situation on the top. I don't know. Let's try it. Oh yeah, it is so good. Mmm, it's perfect. Got one more stop and then I'm gonna go back and get my nails taken off. They were cute though, but it broke in it. Yeah, like look, look at this set. Like it was cute, but it's time for them to go. Hey guys. Okay, so I am home, y'all. My hair's all twisted up. And <laughs> back home, I went, um, sorry for, y'all, sorry for this. I been folding clothes, so I have clothes everywhere. I don't even know if I wanna show y'all, I'm scared. Literally clothes everywhere, been folding all day. Look at Aunt Jamima, y'all better go follow her. I mean, why call her Aunt Jamima? Miss Jamima. I love her, I'm washing her. Literally water. clothes everywhere, look behind me. So, I'm about to untwist my hair. I'm gonna twist them in smaller twists so that I can put my wig on, my wig won't look lumpy as it's been looking lumpy all week. Oh, I like me a little pushback, I look cute. So yeah, I've been wearing my hair like this under my waist because I kinda wanna wear my natural hair out when I come back from Dallas. Should tell you guys about this crumble cookie. I want a crumble cookie two days ago, y'all. It takes me a while to eat these cookies, y'all. They're huge and they're just, they're huge. So this is the pink sugar classic cookie. It's chilled and it tastes so good. Mm-hmm. Honestly, I think that's the best cookie I have from Crumble. It's just like a cake and a cookie. It's so good. I wanted to go out for a walk, y'all, but if it's too dark by the time I'm done taking my nails out, we'll go to the gym. Let's actually untwist it together right now. I want, to, I want you guys to see. Y'all, my hair grew so much. Ooh. I'm so not gentle with my hair. My hair grew so much. Look at this. Like, what? See what happens when you're not gentle? Breakage. You gotta be more gentle with your hair. I use Miel product. I've been more intentional about what I wear going out. 
because you know i don't mind wearing the gym look like today i had on the gym look today but i don't mind wearing the gym look but no we're not doing the gym look no more unless we're actually going to the gym so i've been more intentional the past like three days going out i've been wearing dresses and just looking really cute making sure my eyebrows are good keeping my lips glossed and you know moisturized and it's just like the way I carry myself, you know, wearing a bag. Not to say I wasn't doing these things before, y'all, but I've just been more intentional about doing it more often these past three days. And y'all, when I tell y'all, I got so many compliments, so many compliments from so many different types of people. And I just wanted to tell you guys about that just in case. Because I'm not team bonnet in the street wearing like i'm not gonna be wearing my bonnet to the airport i'm not wearing my bonnet to go to the grocery store especially if you're a single woman and you're you know you know you're just being like open to meeting people you gotta really be aware of what you're wearing and be besides all of that too just in general I really believe like the first thing that people judge you on when they meet you is your appearance. So if you look raggedy, baby, I'm not gonna take you serious. The first thing that people judge you on is your looks. And it's true, cause like, baby, you didn't even take the time to take care of yourself this morning. I don't know, how did I get on this whole rant? Oh yeah, so I just say all that to say, be more cautious of what you wear out you know don't be so lollygaggy about what you're wearing like actually care about that and my mom used to always stress that to me like like i said i i be stepping i be making sure i wear i be looking good i want to start wearing my natural hair more often how cute and this is before i kind of like poof i've always been First of all, I love that. Kind of like real serious about what I wear. Wherever I'm going, I like to look good. I love to look good, baby. I think you guys can tell by my blogs. Like, when I look good, I feel good, honey. I feel like... I feel like... I don't know. I just feel like I can conquer the world. Like, y'all just did my hair with me. So, yeah. I just say all that to say, you know, be more cautious about what you're wearing. Where you're, whether you're a guy or a girl. Like, I'm not saying this to just my girlies. Like, everybody, be more conscious of what you're wearing because people really judge you. The first thing that a stranger will judge you off of is your looks. What are you looking like? What do you have on? If I'm networking with someone that I met at the mall and I got this gym clothes on, like, what are you doing? So, you know, you got to make sure you look presentable at all times. I twisted most of the front i just want to show y'all how much my hair grew like wow wow literally i was girl that's another topic that's the people i want to be around because that's, that's what i'm giving mm -hmm. that's all I'm giving guys on. i did my nails so i decided to not only get a soak up but to actually paint my nails y'all and i'm doing something super simple this is my natural nose with gel polish on them i love them so so much neutral i'm just giving grown women let's give it grown and sexy <laughs> i love them like wow you all see it yeah perfect perfect so clean so elegant yeah so we're going to the chill <laughs> Time to unbreak this back, y'all.
Good morning, y'all. It is 3.44 in the morning. I'm about 15 minutes away from the airport. My flight leaves at 6.15. I'm sleepy. I have had how many sleep? How many hours? I slept for like 30 minutes. <laughs> so I'm going to sleep on the flight. So this is my first time driving to the airport. I'm going to figure out this parking situation. I have two hours in advance to figure it all out. I made it to the airport, y'all. Everything went smoothly. It was very easy. More self explanatory than I thought. Please close the boarding door of the airplane. Flight attendants, arm your doors, cross the check. That's where we watch fireworks. I'm in Texas, baby. Yo, the last time I was in Texas was in April. That's crazy. But yeah, we're in Texas. Hey y'all, I am all settled in finally. I am super tired. It is 9.35 Texas time because it's an hour behind here in Texas. So 9.35, I think I'm gonna take like a three hour nap and then head out around one to go eat and explore the city. Hopefully it's not raining because it looks like it's about to rain. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know where to go. I'm about to go on TikTok. Before I take a nap, I'm going to go on TikTok and see, like, what's the move, you know? Maybe go to a happy hour somewhere. That would be nice. Sit down, eat, enjoy myself. So I'm going to take a nap, wake up, shower, put on my outfit, and head out. So I'll probably see you guys later. <sighs> Dallas, Texas, what's up, baby? Here are the Texas views, y'all. It's so hot out here. I'm gonna check the room. All right, y'all, so this is the fit. A nice green two-piece that I got from Fashion Nova. Well, yeah, it's from Fashion Nova. And yeah, I'm wearing black, black purse, black shoes. And yeah, I'm about to head down. I'm going to a restaurant called Boone Bistro. It's a Thai type of restaurant. So I'm excited to try something new. Y'all, is it weird if I bring my tripod? Because I'm going to have to carry my tripod in my hand. Let me show you. So, because my purse is so small and I want to take my own pictures, I'm going to have to, yeah, I think this is like, it looks like a weapon. If somebody try to, you know, because I'm be by myself, so... <laughs> So yeah, let's go. All right, y'all, we made it to Boom Lyo Thai Bistro. And yeah, Texas is so empty, y'all, look. So nice, but yeah, we're about to go eat, but I'm gonna take pictures first while the sun is sunning. Can y'all see me? Look at my outfit. Guys, we're here. So this restaurant is like a family-owned restaurant. They got the they got the kids running around in here. I don't really mind that. It's like, I've been, my mom used to own a business and I know what it's like. So I don't really care for that, but that's, I love it here. It's very intimate and I hope y'all can hear me. Kind of private, I like it. It's low key. I'm the only one here, so yeah. I ordered the Thai tea boba and then I'm gonna get the chicken spring rolls and then I'm also gonna have I, I wanna try pho because of Jai nice if y'all watch Jai nice I wanna try pho pho let me keep looking at the menu y'all I'll show y'all my favorite so I have the Thai ice boba tea I think it's called and then I got chicken spring rolls so alright y'all we're gonna try the chicken spring rolls first I'm trying to say the sauce is here. This one is like. Mmm. 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 
I'm sure you're good now. I'm gonna get cold. I'm gonna get fried rice. Mmm. This is so good. Yeah, I ordered full. I'm excited to try full. That is very nice. This is so light. And airy. It's so good. All right, y'all. Here is my food, my beef jerky. This is good. Everything is good. I love everything so far. We're gonna try the food together, y'all. Let's try it together. All right, y'all. We're eating together, y'all. My date. Eating by yourself is so relaxing. All right. First, I need to see how much spice I need to add. I'm scared. Play with it. Don't play with it. Hold on now. This is probably gonna be the only thing I eat. Everything else I'm taking home. I don't even understand the amount of food I have on this table right now. Like, I think it's probably I'm getting better with the chocolate. I did not expect that to be so good. Wow. 
it's sweet, it's salty, but what's on my apple? Go down. I think it's good tonight. The zippo is about to slap. I'm gonna try it with the beef jerky. Mm. It's a little good. Ooh, this is so good. This is a 10 out of 10. The best fried rice I've had in a while. Wow. Mm. That is so good. I said I want to finish this full, but I don't know if I'm going to finish it. Huh? I think I can finish it. It's soup. I got this. I'll be like a toddler, y'all. Like, I don't have a big appetite at all. I get food so easy. I don't know why I got this food. Alright y'all, I'm back. The food was so good, y'all. Y'all heard me graving about that food. It was amazing. I would definitely go back there. Best fried rice I had in a while. Like oh, everything amazing. I got so much leftovers. I got enough to feed me for the next two days. Like I have a lot of leftovers. I'm about to go take pictures in this outfit. If I get cute enough pictures, I'll post on IG. <laughs> I'll probably do like a thread, a Dallas thread, but um, I'm about to take some pictures. Then I'm gonna head to the gym in the next 20, 30 minutes. And then I'll probably be there for like 45 minutes and that'll be my day. Gym, chill. And then yeah, I'll probably work on content or something tonight. Yeah, so that's the day. Really chill, really simple, really cool. You know what I'm saying? And then tomorrow is another big day. I probably won't record too much tomorrow. Again, this is another short Dallas vlog, but I'm gonna come back here probably one more time before the year ends. And there I will do more a more extensive vlog, showing the city, going to more places, just exploring Dallas right now. I'm trying to make some moves out here real quick. And then, you know, eventually we'll really explore the city. I love it. It's quiet it's more of a slower pace compared to miami where i was born and raised so you know it's different and i like it so all right y'all i'm done rambling let me go take my pictures before the sun goes down and then we're gonna head to the gym right, so i didn't really like my pictures that's like outside i'm gonna try to get some pictures in here let me turn off some lights uh, i don't really like these lights <laughs> let me see okay that's a little better bring no gym shoes but we're gonna work out regardless no excuses i'm working on working out in my socks right, y'all i'm gonna finally go to the gym y'all i'm procrastinating what happened i ended up putting my clothes back on y'all to go take pictures because it was golden hour and i was like these pictures gonna look good with this golden hour lighting but i put my clothes back on when i started to take pictures and i still didn't really like the lighting so i give up whatever i got is what i got now it's 8, 8, it's 8 p.m. I'm going to go to the gym. I'm going to try to be out there for like an hour. I'm going to grab a bottle of water. What do I need? A bottle of water. I'm going to grab a bottle of water. This lighting is amazing. I'm going to make sure the doors are locked. I got my water. The only thing I need is my phones. I got my other phone. All right, y'all. She was like, oh, the same cousin. You remember my cousin? I think he spoke to her for a little bit. She lives in Houston. She was like, all right, y'all, I'm grabbing my key and we're going to the gym. I'm not gonna lie, y'all, 
I'm dying. I am dying. <laughs> to be honest but we back on grind time like i begin this burst of like motivation and energy to accomplish so many things out of nowhere i love it anyway this is a reminder to give yourself grace and don't be too hard on yourself you're doing amazing i don't know who needs to hear that but i just wanted to say that give yourself grace because you're doing amazing sweetie you're doing amazing this next upcoming vlog is about to be so good so eventful yeah, it's a lot going on. You guys just gonna have to stay tuned for the next vlog. If you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe, join the fam, y'all. And I will see you guys on my next video. I love you guys. Bye.